Hey everybody, welcome to Traditional Bow Hunting Wilderness Podcast. This is Jason Sam Kovac, and today we're going to take a look at some awesome feathers. Okay, these things are amazing. This just came in a box in the mail to me and I uh, got it and it was, I didn't know what it was, had no idea. I opened it, um, but I'm very excited about them and uh, we'll tell you about it. But basically, um, Chuck, who you guys know, my good friend, Chuck Morris, and uh, he's out there in Missouri. He also is the one that invented that Chuck Morris cold shot, that shot process that he came up with where you have the consequences and the, uh, you got to pay the price for bad shots on your cold shots. And it's been a, a game changer type tactic. And a uh, real good friend of mine. And uh, we were talking about feathers. And I was telling him the prices of feathers got ridiculous, this kind of stuff. He was talking about, uh, you know, how he's been collecting his own and doing them. I thought that's pretty cool. Well, I get this package in the mail and it says on here, uh, Jason, please in, or enclose, please find the left wing portion of the feathers I collected last season from my turkeys and had processed by wild fletchings, uh, John Ectorling, Ector and then dyed them using one of his dye products. His dye products are the best I've ever used. Uh, these are for your own use or bless someone with them. Feel free to do whatever you wish with them, including pass them on to your followers, Patreon, whatever. I've included Josh's card in here for well. If you have any questions for him or anything, he's a great guy to deal with and I have nothing but great things and kudos to say about him. Uh, hope this finds you well and you're doing good and staying tick free down there in Georgia. Um, so this... What this is, is these are actual real turkey feathers from the turkeys that uh, Chuck has killed. And, uh, he, you know, he's very fortunate in his turkey hunting. But these are the left wings. He shoots right wing. These are the left wings, which is what I shoot. And uh, so he took these feathers. He took all those turkey feathers, sent them in to Josh. Which here is Josh's info for you right here. There you go. But... He sent all of this stuff right to Josh. Josh then processed those feathers, got them set, and then uh, now he will. Josh will also sell already pre-made feathers that are done like this, wild feathers on his site, which you're seeing, or you will see. But he also sells the dye for him. Well, then uh, since Chuck already had to dye, he actually dyed these too when they came back. So he dyed them using dye from Josh and uh, you can see he labels everything set perfect so you know what they are and you have all the details there um, and uh, I got all these feathers um, and as you read in his note he said I could give some of these away or do whatever I want to I'm sorry you guys aren't getting them I'm using these, these this color is pretty awesome uh, this this fluorescent green dye that he used on these is actually amazing in color it's going to kind of dull out a little bit as we get closer there let me get out of there for focus purposes. Um, but man, these feathers are nice. Um, well done. Like I said, they're, they're going to be fantastic. I got a bunch of them here, so I'm going to be in business. And uh, right now I have enough arrows made to last me for a while. But when I have to do more, these are going to be the feathers that I'm going to use. I love the color combo on them. I'm excited. I don't know if I'll use them as a cock feather um, only feather or what I'm going to do, but I'm excited to have these. It's pretty awesome that, you know, that Chuck sent them to me and that these are actually feathers off of turkeys that he's harvested. That's got a lot of value and sentimental aspect to them. Um, but the quality of what he did in the processing of these and the making of these feathers is nothing short of amazing. I mean, I'm going to bring you in here and show you some of these grinds so you can see them. Look at the quality of the work he did, that Josh did processing these. I mean, these are fantastic. These are absolutely awesome feathers and real turkey feathers, but I mean, that is incredible. Thickness on that is still real good. I mean, he, he nailed it on these feathers and I will chop them myself, but I mean, the quality of these and that dye is just straight up nothing short of flawless so um i'm really impressed this is pretty amazing now i don't turkey hunt so i don't ever get turkey feathers but i knew you guys do and this might be a fantastic way for you guys to be able to take advantage of some of this stuff and use you know feather costs are ridiculously expensive and then uh, but being able to supply your own have them processed for you turn around dye them whatever color you want all this stuff done um you know josh does that so he's got all this information right here his website's right on there um, this is a shout out to him uh, for what he is capable of and his stuff that he's doing. Straight up phenomenal. And a big thanks to Chuck for these because like I said, I'm going to use them. He said I could give them away or do whatever I want to because um, he won't use them being left wing. I'm going to use them. 
These things are straight up amazing. So, uh, and I've never shot real turkey feathers before. Like I said, I don't turkey hunt. If I did, I would have had some process, but I just don't, I don't have the time for turkey hunting. But to actually have these and come from somebody that I, I you know, I consider family, it's pretty amazing. This is awesome stuff. I'm very excited about it. And I wanted to share it with you guys and let you know um, what can be done with your turkey feathers and how you can reuse them. If you don't know how to grind them and you don't want to go through the process of doing all this stuff and making your own and everything, um, Josh will take care of it for you. And like I said, dyes, whatever you need, it's all right there for you. So little short video for you on some amazing stuff that, uh, that that's out there and uh, that I'm excited to have. So there you go. Thanks for watching.